Hello friends, this video on equilibrium part 32 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching the video, please make sure that you have watched all the previous parts. So we have done ionization of weak acid. Let's do ionization of weak base similar to that. So now we have some weak base MOH. It dissociates into M plus and OH minus ions. And the KB here will be M plus ions by OH minus ions into MOH. It has a KB. Similar to the equilibrium constant we had. And if you see here, uh, this value, value is nothing but C alpha square by 1 minus alpha. How you get? Example, I assume that at T is, I'm going to write this equation here, and H gives M plus plus O H minus N. T is equal to 0, let's assume it was C, it was 0, it was 0. At T is equal to equilibrium, let's assume it this becomes C into 1 minus alpha. This becomes C alpha and this becomes C alpha. So if you solve uh, for this, you put the value of, for uh, example, this becomes C alpha into C alpha by C into 1 minus alpha. It gets cancelled, this becomes C alpha square by 1 minus alpha. So the KV is nothing but C alpha square by 1 minus alpha. Similarly, PKB is minus log of KV. And here also we have some of the ionization constant of the weak base at 298 Kelvin. So if you see, this is the values we have got just for the reference. We will take some examples of the ionization constant of uh, ionization of weak base. So the pH of a point 04 hydrogen solution is 9.7. We have to find the ionization constant K, B and P. So let's write the reaction first. The reaction goes NH2, NH2. If we add water to this, this becomes NH2, NH3 plus and OH plus. So T is equal to 0, this is 0 0.004 M, this is not required, this is 0 and this is 0. At T is equal to equilibrium, this becomes 0 0.004 minus X, this is not required, this becomes X and it becomes X. The pH is given, so pH is what? So from pH I can find the H plus ion concentration, right? So H plus ion concentration will be what? NT log of? Minus 9.7. This guy. This comes out to be 1.67 into the power minus 10. So if this guy is H plus ion concentration, OH minus concentration will be what? I know that H plus into OH minus concentration is nothing but 10 to the power minus 14. This is uh, KW. This is something I know. So I can find OH minus also. OH minus is nothing but 10 to the power minus 14 by H plus that is 1.67 into 10 to the power minus 10. So this gives me 5.98 into 10 to the power minus 10. This is my x. Correct. I got the value of x. I can easily find the value of kb now. So kb will be what? x square by 0 0.04 0 0.004 minus x. Put the values. This becomes 5.98 into 10 to the power minus 5 square by 0 0.004 minus this value is almost equal to 0 0.004. You solve this, you get 8.96 into the minus. So I got the value of KB. Finding PKB is very easy. There is nothing but minus log of KB. There is nothing but minus log of 8.96 into the minus 7. You solve this, you get 6.04. And that is the PKB of the solution. Let's take one more example. The pH of a solution formed by mixing 0.2 M NH4Cl and 0.1 M NH3. We need to find the pH. The pOH of ammonia is 4.75. Let's try to find the reaction. So the reaction here will be if you see, I have ammonia plus if you do it with water, this gives me NH4 plus and OH minus. Correct. It says that uh, the pH by mixing 0.2 M NH4Cl. So at T is equal to 0, this was 0.2 M. 0.1 M NH3, this was 0.1 M. This is not required and this is something which is 0. At T is equal to 0. At T is equal to equilibrium, this moves in this direction. This becomes 0.1 minus X. You add X to this and you add X to this. This is the value of 
uh, equilibrium. Uh, this is the concentration of the species at equilibrium. Kb is Kb given. Kb is not given, but POH is given. So the, for the POH of this, uh, sorry, uh, is four point seven five. For the whole thing, I can find the Kb. So there is a mistake here. POH is not given because if POH is given, things are very easy to find. I can find pH very easily. It's pKb is given. See, if POH is given, I can find pH is nothing but 14 minus as well. So pKb is given, right? So pKb is given. So with that, I can find Kb. So Kb is what? 10 to the power minus 4.75. This is nothing but 1.77 into 10 to the power minus 5. Correct? Because pKb is given, I can find Kb. So I got the Kb. So Kb is nothing but 0.2 plus x, that is NH4 plus concentration into x, that is OH minus concentration by NH3 concentration, that is 0.1 minus x. And this value is nothing but 1.77 into 10 to the power minus 5. Correct. So if you solve, you get x as 0.88 into 10 to the power minus 5. This is the value of x. And this is what I was looking for because with x is nothing but my OH minus ion concentration. I have the OH minus ion concentration, I can find the H plus ion concentration very easily. There is nothing but 10 to the power minus 14 by OH minus ion concentration. Right? Because H plus ion concentration into OH minus ion concentration is nothing but Kw. That is 10 to the power minus 14. So with this, I get 10 to the power minus 14 by 0.88 to the power minus 5. You solve this, you get 1.12 to 10 to the power minus 9. So if H plus ion is this, so pH is nothing but minus log of this value. 1.12 into 10 to the power minus 9. You solve this, you get 8.98. That's the answer. Correct. See, there was the issue in the question. If they have given POH, then it is very easy, you don't need to do anything. Right? If pH is 4.75, so pH, pH will be 14 minus 4.75. That's all. But this is not pH, this is pKb. So we have now learned pKa and pKb. What is the relationship between pKa and pKb? The relationship is pretty simple. pKk into Kb is Kw, that is 10 to the power minus 14 and pKa plus pKb is equal to pKw that is 14. This is a relation. Very easy to find. Let's take one example based on this concept. So the question says the ionization constant of HF, HCOH and HCN and this are these values. We have to find the ionization constant to conjugate base. So the formula we have HF. Let's take HF first. For HF, Ka is given 6.8 into the power minus 4. That is my Ka. I have to find Kb. And I know that Ka into Kb is equal to what? Kw. That is 10 to the power minus 14. So I can find Kb very easily. 10 to the power minus 14 by k. That is only what 10 to the power minus 14 by k was 6.8 into the power minus 4. You solve this, you get 1.5. Now, similarly, let me do one more. HCOH. K is given 1.8 10 to the power minus 4. So Kb is what? 10 to the power minus 14 by k, right? Same relation. And the moment 10 to the power minus 14 by 1.8 10 to the power minus 4. You solve this, you get 5.6 10 to the power minus. Similarly, you can find for HCN also. Just application of formula. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests. Get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.